Well, howdy folks. Welcome back to the series on modular synth that I've been doing. And there is a playlist link in the description if you wanna check that out. Today, we're gonna to talk about oscillators or VCOs, which are these modules up here. This is an analog oscillator, and this is a digital oscillator. Now, what does an oscillator do? Its job is to generate waveforms. So if I told you to draw me a waveform, you'd probably draw something like this, and that is indeed a sine wave. But there are other analog waveforms. Now, if I plug in here, this is called a square wave, and it's an analog waveform, and you can probably see where it gets its name. And then this is called a triangle wave. And again, you can probably see where it gets its name. And if we combine those two, we get something that is called a sawtooth wave. And again, you can probably see where it gets its name. So using our sawtooth here, this controls our pitch. So if I turn it this way, we will see in here it get lower. And if I turn it the opposite way, we will see in here, here it get higher. So we developed a series of pitch voltages that comply to a standard. We'll talk more about that in a later video, but let me just plug it in here. And this is what the VC and VCO stands for, voltage control. Using this voltage, I can make this oscillator honk out a melody by simply changing its waveform. Now, that is an analog oscillator, as I said before, but if we come over here to our digital oscillator, we'll see a waveform that doesn't really resemble those analog waveforms. It's a lot more complex. And as I turn this knob, we'll see that waveform morph and become something totally different than anything we saw on the analog oscillator but it still should be able to respond to our voltage control. So if we plug that in here, we should again hear something that resembles that melody. So there you go. That is what an oscillator does. 